Couture, Beatty, and Radford, the guards. And for Villanova, Gillespie, Moore, Samuels, the outstanding Jeremiah Robinson, Earl, all return along with Tulane transfer Caleb Daniels. Villanova's shown they can do it, and I think this year, year two for Mike Young, he's going to have to have that adjustment for his team in the ACC, which would likely be a shortened season as Gillespie knocks down the three. Here's Aline flanked by Robinson Earl, one of the great defenders in the country, and Aline gets a three up and over him with one second on the shot clock. And the rebound cleared by the Hokies and Tyrese Radford. Underneath, nobody got to Aluma. And Kebe Aluma has an early six. He's three for three. Can we pick up our communication? Can we identify risks on the floor? Can we get back in transition and start to take control of this basketball game? Because right now they're getting driven. Tech can hold for the final shot. Jada with an attack. Cartier Jada smothered by Slater. A three from Beatty is no good. And that's how the first half ends. Five assists as a team. Yeah, that's, that's part of it. Now, part of that is how they played through Gillespie with a hot hand. He, he's created a lot for himself. Aline! Yeah. Naheem Aline, his second three of the game. He's got eight. It's exactly what jumped out at me looking at that replay. His eyes are never all stationary, Colin Gillespie. 20 points, yeah, three assists. How about a fourth assist, Robinson Earl? It was that moment where you hear about Temple and you're like, ah. And you're like, we got Villanova. Yeah. Oh. Like, it, yourself, you try not to get too excited because you felt badly for Temple. Of course, uh, everybody's healthy and safe yeah. within yeah. that program. Yeah. Daniel sits at two. This unprecedented season where you just don't have the normal preseason, the normal exhibition. You wonder how polished and, and what kind of chemistry a young team's going to have. It's a great move. Terrific move by Kebe Aluma. Snaps an 11 nothing Villanova run. No, if it doesn't, they have Daniels and that's it. <laughs> That, said, that says everything you need to know about culture and identity. Swider, a three-pointer. Cole Swider, dead-eye shooter. Spot up, catch and shoot, pure shooter. 20 points off of 11 takeaways. Aline with an answer. Naheem Aline, three for four from deep. Robinson Earl, a quiet night. He has only six points. Samuels has the ball now. And Jermaine Samuels scores for the first time. He had started 0 for 5 from the field. Gotta runs the show again, beating on the bench with those four fouls. Aline. Aline buries a three, his fourth of the night. Number four Cavaliers went down to San Francisco yesterday, 61-60. Wow. Number three on the ropes, but Jeremiah Robinson Earl. Beatty looking to feed Aluma. Back out, Beatty for three. Yes! One point game! Virginia Tech can win it with a basket. It's Radford with five to go. Jada, Cartier Jada on the handoff. Wow! Luma, yes, and a foul with 1.3 to go. Here's the closeout. And he's able to get just enough space to draw a defender. And Kevin Aluma, who's had a terrific basketball game with 18 points right now, goes to the free throw line to give Virginia Tech a two-point lead with 1.3 left. I, that was just a terrific individual play. Can tie the game at the line. Not a flagrant foul. There's a personal foul awarded to Mutz. More for the tie. And he hits both free throws. Absolutely crazy. Now Virginia Tech can win it again. Jada for the win. 18 points in the first half, seven in the second. A three. It's good. It's Justin Mutz, who was two for 18 from deep at Delaware last year. Justin Moore only five points in the game, one for six from the field, but he was undeterred for two. Look, he had the two most important points. Jada will use the screen from Aluma. Aline off the shot, fake a two, and Naheem Aline buries it. Virginia Tech's lead back to two possessions. Got good footwork into the shot as well. Good find, Samuels. Another good find, Daniels. Caleb Daniels at three in front of the Villanova bench. Jada in a very difficult spot. Jada got it to Radford, got it to Aluma, got it in the hoop and a chance for a three-point play. Luckily, you know, look, if, if you're on the floor and here's a triple team, he probably traveled on that play. But if you're on the floor, you've got to. Daniels, one more heave. It's short, put back there from Swider. And Villanova will use the timeout.
So there's a lot you're learning about your team if you're Jay Wright. There's a lot you're learning about your team if you're Mike Young. And that's it. 81-73. And Virginia Tech goes giant slaying again. The Hokies take down number three for the second straight season in the Mike Young era. Thanks for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.